means to take advantage of our people. The same thing happened in America between 1955 and 1975, 78, where there was a, a pastor in quotes called James Warren Jones, who did a revolutionary suicidal thing by brainwashing his followers, pretending to be protecting them from some harm of the government. And when they started knowing that he's actually lying to them, when they started running away, they were murdered. So this kind of man is not a pastor. This is a devil worshiper or a terrorist who comes in the name of the Lord. And to those who are unsuspecting, they actually believe, hoping that something good will come out. And that is how they end up being killed or whatever they are doing or sacrificing them. We just want to be sensible as Kenyans, to watch out where we go, where we call churches, how these people who stand on the pulpit tell us or teach us if it is truly coming from the Bible and only the Bible, examples from the Bible. So I need, if possible, the government to use a quick response unit to surround that area with an emergency because this is like a massacre or a mass murdering that has happened there along the years. Now that it has come out and the same person who has been arrested before released, if you look at the bail that was charged, only 10,000. So many lives have been lost. I think somebody somewhere is slipping over his job and not taking any one of a Kenyan life, any Kenyan life serious. We need all the leaders of Kilifi, and they are seated right here, and every leader in Kenya to teach or enlighten their people. We can be talking or uh, saying that the village elders or Nyumbakumi el uh, leaders or the chiefs or the police, whoever we are pointing at the finger, I think all of us in our small churches that have mushroomed in every village, we need to know what exactly are they teaching. Because most of these pastors, some of them are foreigners. They are all over in the corridors of our streets, cheating Kenyans out of their money. Because a greedy pastor, a thief, who came to use the Bible, but only to gain. When I see the Bible, Jesus lost so that somebody else can gain. Why are they gaining and people losing? These are witches, these are wizards, these are con men, thugs or murderers. They are not pastors. Thank you.